What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to uh, the Bianconeri Zone for another preview, it's going fast and uh, it's the last one because there's an international international break again, it's, uh, it's horrible, the timing obviously, um, just for the momentum we have, maybe not for the injuries we have obviously, but just for the momentum, it's a, it's a bad timing in my opinion, however, before we can actually uh, go through uh, the international break. We we do have a Cagliari game, which on paper seems like it's a given in terms of like ah, you need to be Cagliari. We need to be Cagliari, um, but they can they come off a, a very good win. Uh, but again, you know Napoli won. You need to follow now. You cannot go into the break with a big boss from Leipzig and then you know not be Cagliari because that would be a very long break for. For everybody involved, basically, uh, 100%. But before we do that, as always, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, hit that bell notification, and let's talk about how we can, uh, or should be, Cagliari. <laughs> okay, so, <coughs> excuse me. We come off a very emotional week, you know, if it's the result and how we got the result against Leipzig to the injury uh, to Bremer out for a season to the Pogba news, which is like it's an, int like it's an intense week, you know, probably emotions for everybody is uh, off the charts right now. It makes no sense. However, the players need to just focus on the, on the, on the task, task at hand and the task at hand is beating Cagliari, which in my opinion, should not be a problem. Now, again, this recorded just before uh, the presser because I, I couldn't make it afterwards. I'm out. However, I don't know what Mota's going to say. I don't know if there are new injuries. Timothy Weah is back in training. But my assumption is I have a feeling that he's not going to change much before the break. I think he's going to stick to the team that got him basically the win uh, against um, Leipzig. And... To be honest, I don't think he should be making a change right now before the break. You know, the players involved right now, we talk about that. Oh, why isn't he not playing Douglas Luiz? You know, Locatelli got benched for Leipzig. Um, Hild is not, not playing particularly well, to be honest. Uh, we have that injury at the back right now. Like, a lot of question marks. Like, why, why is this happening? Why is that? However, I think before the break, the only thing that Matt before and after the break... I've always said it, especially after the break, but even before, it doesn't like it doesn't really matter. You should be going into the break with a positive feeling, and ideally come out of that break and win that game. You know, no matter who you play, just just find a win, a way, excuse me, to win those games. I think that's the most important thing um, when it comes to international breaks because our games are set up uh, in a very weird way some might say because we go Cagliari we play at home and we come back and we play Lazio at home again so it's not the easy of, of game Lazio but then it gets a bit uh, a bit tricky because you play Stuttgart uh, when you come back you play Stuttgart in the Champions League again at home so you have three home games and then you go away uh, to Inter on the I think this the 27th of yeah the 27th so it is an intense week, you know, it's Lazio, Stuttgart and Inter after the break, you know. Um, that's why you should be dealing with Cagliari. Just use what you did on Sunday, you know, on, uh, on Wednesday, you know, use that energy, that positive energy, that, that boost, you know, not just from the fans, but from, from yourself. Because when we saw them play, these guys look like they could conquer the world on that day. They look like they could beat any team, no matter what the odds were. If it's the refereeing, going down a goal, going down a man, like all hitting the post, you know, and all these things, it felt like no matter what is going to happen, what you're going to throw at these players, they will find a way and they will manage to win that game. Um, you cannot go into that game, obviously, underestimating uh, Cagliari and saying, well, it's 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 a write-off. It's 100% a win and that's it. We cannot do that. However, we should be confident. You know, you should be going into those first five minutes of the game and actually go for it and put them uh, with their backs against the wall, you know, and ideally just finish off that game in the first half as well. Um, and to be honest, I think that's what we're going to do. I think we're going to win this game. And I don't think, even though I, I hate the early kickoffs on the Sunday, it's like... 
maybe it's just like a, a weird thing. However, if you look up the results when we play early kickoffs and the performances, they 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 are stinky. Uh, they are stinky. However, Cagliari will sit back in a low block, one hundred percent. But they don't, in my opinion, they don't have enough quality to do so for ninety minutes. I don't think they have the quality and the ability to make life as difficult like Napoli did or Roma did or even Empoli did. I don't think they do. And to be honest, with the boost we have and the confidence we have, we should be going completely like we should we should be absolutely going for Cagliari and wrapping up that game earlier. So the predicted lineup right now and again I recorded it. Maybe Mota comes out in his presser and gives it eleven again and maybe Savona is not playing and maybe Locatelli is back in the team and <clears throat> for some reason Turam starts could be you know um, or maybe Yildiz get ba- gets benched and we see him Bangula play you know I I don't know what's gonna happen not for Yildiz but in general we don't know however right now I've seen Mota play the, the same thing before the international break I've seen him do it with, with Bologna as well and change it when the players come back after the break you know just use the high, you know, the high wave and, and, and ride it. You know, Vlaovic is, is, is in scintling form right now. You should be using that. Yield this. I use this game to actually get your confidence back a little bit. I don't... Confidence. I don't think confidence. I'm going to say more so just the performance. I don't think he lost confidence. It's just the performances are not really up to what uh, it should be, in my opinion, right now. Um, but for Gatti, for Kalulu, you know, just confirm what you have been doing. We haven't conceded a goal in the league. You know, it's probably going to be a hot topic now. Bremer is out. Will you concede a goal? And if we will concede a goal, it will be dragged through the mud, you know, the entire international break. So keep that clean sheet, I guess, just for, for your own sake. not really much I care about. If you win that game 3 1, I'm not going to care about that goal, nor Thiago Motta is going to care about that goal. Um, but in general, just do what you have to do. Keep it clean. Dominate possession again. Create the chances. Finish those chances. And ideally, do that early on. Put some pressure on Cagliari. Make them fold. And just cruise through that game. Easy three points. That, well, in my opinion, what it should be. So my prediction is going to be 3-0. Uh, because I think we are going to win. I think we should be winning without an issue. Um, and go into that international break with... A great confidence, you know, a uh, great ease because it's been a crazy week, you know. The result, like I said, long term inju- injury for, to Bremer, the Pogba news, like it's gonna be a long international break, whether you like it or not. It better be, it better can be a long one with a positive feeling and knowing that, okay, now we go back against Lazio, which won't be easy. However, it's confidence, and then you have Stuttgart and Inter. Now we need to build on that momentum 100% because now comes the more more tricky part of the season. Uh, it's a middle part, then towards the back end, it's 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 a bit different. However, that's my prediction. Uh, let me know your prediction in the comments. Like the video, subscribe, and I will speak to you guys post game tomorrow. Ciao.